hello friends in this video we are going to talk about implantation what is implantation implantation is a process is a very 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 important process for having a pregnancy when the time of implantation comes we have already a embryo a blastocyst and an endometrium which is prepared for pregnancy which endometrium is prepared for pregnancy the endometrium which is well well estrogenized after that of 5 to 6 days of progesterone so this endometrium will have a very glandular structures and nutrient structures ready to get implanted so the blastocyst penetrates the uterine mucosa that is endometrium so blastocyst is not just attach itself it even penetrates the endometrium it, it goes inside the endometrium with the help of enzymes now the time of fertilization is what sorry the time of implantation is what it's around 6 to 7 days after fertilization which kind of implantation we have in humans we have interstitial implantation that means that the blastocyst goes inside the endometrium and get implanted not just attaching itself to here it goes inside that's called interstitial implantation what is the site of implantation majority in posterior upper segment of uterus but it's again not necessary it is most commonplace whenever there is implantation you know that that the, the blastocysts have to pierce the endometrium and that's why some amount of bleeding is there so the patient comes to you with the, uh, with the history of sexual intercourse and then a slight amount of bleeding that is called Hartman sign which is due to bleeding at the time of implantation and one is Picake sign this because case sign is what for example this is a uterus and this is its endometrium and the implantation happens here like this then the growth of uterus will be asymmetric for some time like this so this asymmetrical goal, uh, growth of the uterus it's called picacke sign There are three phases of implantation if we see the molecular level. First is the opposition when the blastocyst comes in the contact of endometrium. The selectin are the molecule that, are, that is make, uh, having the part in this process. Then the adhesion that means that the blastocyst have now adhesed to the endometrium and the molecules are integrins. The third stage is invasion in which the blastocyst invades the endometrium because of enzymes, metalloproteinases enzymes. So this is how implantation happens. Thank you.